And finally, we have Pinned, which is a sparse, quiet, uh, a sparse, quiet, and slightly distorted piano. Fades in with the rumbly sound of the interior of some kind of vehicle. Is that a train? It's a train. It's a train that acts as an epilogue to the record. And the piano and the singing disappears at about the three-minute mark, dissolving into what sounds like a muted and hard-to-make-out conversation between two or three people. Ford stall fades away. Yeah. Who's talking there and what's the conversation? My sales were up. My sales were up. English guy behind me on his cell phone. French guy in front of me. So there is French in there. I thought I heard uh, French, but I couldn't figure it out. My sales were up. Anyway, I just... Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> There's no reaction, I know. It's, uh, but that, uh, my daughter played the piano thing. And I had my garage band going. I said, can you play this again? And, and she did. And I just liked it. It had a nice little melody. Mm -hmm. And then I was coming home from um, Johnny Faye's dad's funeral. John Faye Sr., great giant of a man in Kingston, a heart surgeon, specializing in children, a giant to our family. He died. Um, the uh, priest said, um, Blessed is he who mourns, for it is he who mourns who can truly love. I didn't say that properly, but basically, uh, if you mourn, you can love. Mm -hmm. um, coming back, I was, uh, you know, I was pretty destroyed, I guess, uh, at the funeral, and uh, came home and uh, got my computer open and garage band, so the second track with the, guitar, with the piano underneath, and just tried to quietly sing these words so as not to feel like a goof. So you did this on a via train? Yeah. And then so the, the, the whistle blasts are all real time. I didn't sort of manipulate that. And they're very timely in the way they sort of happened. And with Chris, we sort of batted around at the end because it felt like the end of broadcast was pretty complete. Right. Finish. And I said, should we, you know, should we put it on? And he just, we both, I think, thought it was just so sort of um, perfect, just the way it came about and how it happened. And well, it doesn't get much more organic and real than that, does it? Yeah. No. Yeah. Um, so that became pinned, and that notion of um, a trailing sash, which uh, the First Nations people of America or anywhere used to wear, and uh, the idea was in battle you take your sash and put your spear through it and pin yourself to the earth and say to the enemy, I'm not retreating. And even if I wanted to, I couldn't. Pinned. Yeah. Wow. My sales were up. <laughs> well, um, so how did I do? Okay? That was great. I, uh, okay. I'm kind of sweating. Well, it's these lights. I'm sweating too. Yeah. Uh, it's well, the company. <laughs> Well, it's 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 a it's a fine record, and it's it's it one Appreciate of those things it. that grow on you because of 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 the subtleties that are involved. I mean, oh, there, apocalypse now. Um, air ambulance. Um, there's a, you know, you can listen to it over and over again, and then you'll pick out the little bits and pieces in the performance, in the lyrics, in the arrangement, in the production that uh, will make it a, a one of those growers. So. Uh, Good on you. Oh, thanks. And I'm um, looking forward to coming up tomorrow night and seeing the whole thing live. Oh, good. Yeah. I tried my best, and uh, we all did. And, uh, you going to tour behind this? We are. You know, we do a bunch of um, festivals this summer, and then sort of a proper tour in the fall. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm looking forward to it. And then after that, we'll just see what happens, right? We'll see what happens. I, I, I'm always looking for the company, so I always have something in front of me to do, mm -hmm. to work on. Um, so, what, us. what haven't you accomplished yet that you would like to? Oh, I don't know. Let's retrace here. What's some things that you would be afraid of not having, not doing? Uh, I don't, I haven't thought about that, Alan. Um, I mean, things come to you, things are, are presented to you, opportunities present themselves. I'm always writing every day on a, in terms of the work. I mean, yeah, I'm, uh, I write every day, I work at it, I enjoy the company. 
of making a record, of making things. Uh, I like challenges that present themselves. Um, but all of that is really nothing compared to, you know, what I would like to accomplish as, say, a father. Mm. Well, not to say a father, as a father or a husband. Um, I want to express my best feelings perfectly. Given time and space, that's what I try and do. Right. Uh, and in order to do that, I guess it's pretty much all about living in the moment. Yeah. Being receptive and open and uh, interested. Mm. Not interesting. Well, thanks very much for coming. I appreciate the opportunity, and uh, good luck with the record, and we'll see you tomorrow night. Thank you, Alan, very much. Thank you.